What are code review anti-patterns? Have you ever wondered why some code reviews seem to drag on forever or leave developers feeling frustrated? The answer might lie in code review anti-patterns. These are common practices that can actually harm the code review process. Understanding these anti-patterns can help teams improve their code quality and create a more positive work environment. A code review is a process where team members look over each other's code changes before those changes are added to the main code base. The main goal is to catch bugs, enhance code quality, and share knowledge among team members. However, when bad habits creep in, they can turn into anti-patterns that slow down progress and lower morale. One common anti-pattern is withholding approval for personal preferences. This occurs when a reviewer blocks code approval simply because they want changes that match their personal style. For instance, insisting on a different variable name or formatting style that does not impact the code's functionality can waste time and frustrate developers. Another issue is requesting unrelated refactors. Sometimes, a reviewer might demand significant changes to parts of the code base that are not connected to the current task. This can overwhelm the developer and delay important work, especially if the reviewer is more senior and their requests feel like orders. Being excessive or nitpicky is another anti-pattern. Reviewers may point out every minor issue, even if it does not affect the code's quality. While attention to detail is important, focusing too much on trivial matters can make the review process tedious and discouraging for the developer. Toxicity or personal bias can also creep into code reviews. Sometimes, comments may attack the developer rather than the code itself. This behavior can harm team relationships and make people hesitant to participate in future reviews. Lastly, a lack of clear guidelines can lead to confusion during code reviews. When teams do not have established rules or goals, reviewers may not know what to focus on, resulting in inconsistent feedback. Setting clear, team-specific guidelines helps everyone understand the purpose and expectations of code reviews. For those learning or teaching programming best practices, recognizing and avoiding these anti-patterns is essential. Setting clear objectives for each review can help keep the focus on functionality and maintainability. Always direct feedback at the code, not the person, to maintain a constructive atmosphere. Limiting the scope of requested changes to those relevant to the current task can also help. Larger refactors should be saved for dedicated tickets or future work. Additionally, using tools to automate style checks can allow reviewers to concentrate on more significant issues. Encouraging positive communication is vital. Creating an environment where feedback is given respectfully and received openly can make the review process more enjoyable. By understanding and avoiding code review anti-patterns, teams can make their reviews more efficient and effective, ultimately leading to better code quality and a happier team.